Good morning everyone, this is Trafalgar Valentine. How is it going today? Today I'll be doing like another insect drawing. Today it's going to be a moth. So to start off with, I'm just going to do the head. I'm just doing this in a 0.3 uh, graphics pen, but you can do this in pencil if you want to try drawing one. I'm going to start off with the eye. So just... Do a little dot there. Zoom in a little bit so you can see. Then for the head, I'm just doing some little lines. Just going up here. Let's do the antenna. Then let's start with the legs. So they're merely in three sections. And it's got three legs either side. So we'll start one here, here, and here. Then we'll trail these down to little sections. Just like so. Then we'll start with the body. The body's quite furry, so I'm just going to do this with not a straight line, but slightly jagged lines. Just going at an angle. Actually, we'll make this a bit bigger, so it'll come down a bit further. Here. Then bring the line on the top. Just going on diagonal, so across here. Let's do the wings now. So we'll start drawing up and down. Get that nice wing shape. Then do the second wing behind it. Just coming up around here and do those curved lines at the end. And then we'll do the body as well, the rest of it. So we should do this in sections again. This is just a fun little drawing, one inch by one inch, or it's not that big. And this tapers off to a small cone shape. Okay, starting to look nice. Now I'm just got a bit of black here. Just doing diagonal lines going across. Making sure this side is all filled in, and then I've got these loose lines on this side. Go right up to the wing edge, and we'll do it for the second one. I'm just going to do like these exaggerated C shapes, and just follow this all up the wing. And then just fill a little bit this side in black. And do the same on this side. So again, the C shapes. Colour it in black. Then for this side. Okay, so that's the main body all pretty much all done. So I'm just going to go with a bit more colour now. I'll make this kind of a pretty moth. Moths are usually like beiges and browns and greys and stuff. Some are some are quite colourful and things, but so I'm sure I'll go with the purple for the wings. I should do a few lines going across. Just across here, one there. I'm just going to add circles in this wing. And do the same on this side. Just filling these small lines down just with this purple pen.
Okay, now do a bit of purple on the body and just fill in these outer edges and then curling it a little bit upwards towards the centre. Okay, now that that's purple's done, let's go on with a bit of pink now. So I'm just going around some of those purples and just highlighting it up with the pink. and pink on this side of the wing as well just kind of highlighting the purples then I'll do a little bit on the body here might make these uh, legs pink as well I'm not really doing this from a photo reference I'm just kind of doing it from memory but uh, I think it's from an old art book that I saw when I first saw this kind of picture. Yeah, it's just a little cute little moth. Now I'm going to add some blue. Kind of a dark and blue, maybe ultramarine now that I look at it properly. Going across the body like so, and add some cross hatches on this rear section. And the blue that I've just done, I'm just going to highlight again with a slightly lighter one. I go over the previous blue lines I've done, I'm just kind of colouring it in. So those lines give it a bit of a nice texture. Okay, I'll just continue just doing this wing down here just with the blue. Now I just want to even out some of these tones just with a blue pencil. like so, now I might do a little shadow at the bottom a little bit of shadow on the antenna
just darkening some more areas, just where they need darkening. And there we are, cute little moth. Just a little drawing, but thanks very much for watching. I'll see you later.